Hey guys, back with another video, this time for Silo. Uh, Silo I consider fairly easy. It can be a giant pain in the ass though, just because there's a lot you have to remember, especially on Double O Agent. So, I'm just gonna talk over this gameplay I got here. Um, this mission can become a major um, clusterfuck just simply because this is the first mission that is pretty much a pure firefight. Um, but, uh, what I found, if you use the PP7 Silence, the, your first gun you get, you start with for as long as you can before you swap over to the KF7, um, it makes it a lot easier on you, so I'm, and, also the thing is you just need to take cover where you can and get headshots where you can, there's one on that guy, and I need a headshot on that guy, but I didn't care, I just wanted him dead. Um, the reason you want to use the PP7 silence, especially in these first couple of, through the first bit of the silo here, is because, um, the noise will draw out the guys from up above and make sure you plant those plastiques, and those green things on the table that you need to pick those up, um, it will draw, the noise from your KF7 will draw out the other enemies. So he's down. I took a hit there. He's down. So boom, headshot on that guy. Uh, this guy I think you do want to take out because when if you do start using the KF7 um, in the next uh, big room with the scientist, uh, he will. Um, and I, yeah, I don't know how the hell he hit me there, but he did. That's annoying. So yeah, just take him out. And my axe is complete shit there, I got a headshot there. Oh, my axe you see in this game is not the best. So I'm waiting for the smoke to clear here. That smoke is a... It's very hard to see through. That smoke is very, very hard to see through. So I'm just cheesing the uh, computer with um, how I know this level works. If you stick close to the wall, they have a bit of an issue hitting you. Yeah, I took another hit there. Yeah, I take a lot of hits in this level. Uh, he has a key code. There, and on that um, computer right there, there was a uh, circuit board. Now, you're gonna notice here, I forget to point the plastic. That was my one problem with this mission. There was a lot to do. And my brain forgets about the plastic, so now I'm swapping over to the KF7. This is where you really want to use that KF7 because it it works really nicely with just uh, being able to take out guards really fast. There's a guard around the corner here, so yeah, I nearly got flanked there. So it's like shit. I just took another hit, and another hit! The, I was so scared I was not going to get this completed, man, because... You're guaranteed to take at least one hit, by the way. At least at the end of this, when you meet Otomov, so... Yeah. So I'm just using that door frame as cover, just so I don't get my ass shot off. Uh, kill them. Die, everybody. Yeah, part of this game being getting good at it is just knowing how the AI works. And it's here I realized, shit, I forgot to uh, plant a bomb. So, that's the only thing, I'm just running back to plant the bomb so, you know, I have all the objectives complete. Because you need to complete all the objectives with the mission or you fail. So, oh uh, yeah, 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 I can't believe I forgot to do this. You know, now that I think about it, objective E in this game is minimize scientist casualties. I guess you're supposed to assume they all escape when you come running in with your gun, but 
So it's also a thing like they may not have escaped. Yeah, and that guy dropped the DAT. You need that. Um, there's a key. There's a circuit board there. That guy has a key card. But you also gotta think about it. I mean, you're planting bombs, so you're going to kill the scientist pretty much anyway. I guess if it looks like an accidental explosion, uh, MI6 can't be held accountable for it. So yeah, I'm just using the, uh, I'm just using the target, the uh, aiming, manual aiming just for that. And now you get armor here. Um, it is not a full armor. I, I don't even know what that'd be. That'd be maybe a quarter armor, a third of your armor bar. But yeah, you don't get a lot of armor, which is annoying. So that armor is a quarter armor, it's not even a full armor, so does it help? Yes. Um it it's gone though, if you don't do this correctly, it's gone in half a second. So yeah. I love how in the Xbox version by the way is what I play on, because I don't have an N64 or the means to record my N64 footage. Um ow. The uh collision detector is broken as fuck and it's I just find this fucking hilarious. So this is the last room you need to plant a bomb in, and also the last room with the with the golden eye satellite itself, so yeah. I like I like this level. This is this simply because it's point A to point B and kill everybody but the scientist. So what I'm doing is just there's a whole lot of guards in this room, including Otomov. Uh, Otomov, you can't actually kill with another weapon, with, the, with a weapon that's not in this game, this level. So he didn't hit me. Usually he gets a shot off on you. Um, now I'm just gonna run and gun and make sure that. So usually I just get in the get in the uh, thing here, but he I decided to just turn back and uh, kill these guys off just. Yeah, I could. I'm just making sure it's all done. And yes, level complete. So yeah, that's kind of the easy way to get through that. I that I, that was not a smooth run by any means. That's any means. Uh, so if you did enjoy this video, please like, comment, and subscribe. Uh, I have more GoldenEye videos planned. I have a whole lot more planned. So I'll see you guys next time. Wolfpack92 signing out.